Hello my viewers, I want to talk about something that frustrates any tech that's been into the business for a while and that's flag terminals. Whoops, okay, ready? Okay, sure, it's real easy. Just um, strip your wire, okay? And after piddling around with trying to make this connection with every single crimping connector you have, okay, you wonder what was the factory thinking? Why don't they make a decent crimper for flag terminals? Okay, so you go ahead and strip your wire back, you know, with whatever you might have. Um, some insulation and is a little tougher than others. <laughs> Um, especially old wire. There we go. And then uh, might even give the strand wire a little twist. Take your flag terminal right here. And then you can figure out a good way to try to crimp this thing. Maybe like this with your Try to get it set in there with your Lyman pliers. And then maybe even take your other crimpers here and try to straighten things out a little bit. Crimp it a little tighter and then try to get the uh, other side here a little tighter with your Lyman pliers and um, well you kind of get the picture here there's no real good way to you know to get this flag terminal on the wire I mean uh, not with out the proper tools anyway um, and I mean what would it hurt for a company some somebody out there to make a decent crimping tool for flag terminals. I mean, really, isn't there any money involved in that? I mean, isn't there somebody out there that's, you know, uh, interested in may maybe inventing something? I don't know. So anyway, this is what you usually get after you've played around with the connection long enough. Something that might work. Still looks like crap as far as I'm concerned, but that's what you get. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to make a flag terminal crimping tool with this crimping tool. I'm going to cut the cutter end off. Uh, I guess I'm going to go ahead and um, grind it off. Here it is. All right, let's try this again now with uh, another flag terminal. Put the wire through there. And now I'm going to use my crimping tool. See how I cut the wire cutter portion off of, of it off of there to do this. And I can go ahead and really get in there and uh, crimp the the uh, connectors where they need to be really good this little try here and there you have it well, I mean, that's a lot easier anyway than, than uh, without it anyway, that's for sure.